This is Terry. He's in his 70s. He's also a member of the Backcountry Horsemen of America. That's a nonprofit made up of people on horseback who help maintain our local mountain trails. He rides horses sometimes, but he prefers his buddy Blackjack the Mule. Terry also found out Blackjack does not like drones. How lucky am I to be out here? 15 miles from anywhere. For Terry Jones, nothing compares to getting on the back of a mule and going for a trail ride. Now retired, he wanted to find a way to put his two loves to good use. He joined the Backcountry Horsemen of America, riders and their horses that keep mountain trails open and safe to the public. You know, they get overgrown with brush, trees fall down, lightning, uh, snow slides, all that kind of stuff. And, and the way that those trails stay open is from groups like ours. Sunday, they hauled logs out of Bristlecone Trail near Lee Canyon. On their way down the mountain. Once it came over the top, it actually came, it descended and was following my mule down the trailer. It sent Terry's mule blackjack into a frenzy. And he did a couple of jumps, a little buck, and then he took off like a bat out of hell. I mean, like there was a banshee on his tail. And Terry on his back. Blackjack wouldn't calm down. Terry thought it'd be safer to jump off, and he did. A broken rib, shoulder, fractured back, and stapled head later, another rider got Terry to the hospital. You know, up to that point, it was like, oh, well, you know, it was a drone, and it was this chance encounter, and blah, blah, blah. But then the drone reappeared. It, now it's no longer a chance encounter, it's intentional. Terry doesn't know who flew the drone, or why. And the thing about drones is they sound like bees. And because bees and horses don't mix, that's one of the reasons that drones are so high on the awareness scale for, for animals. The Federal Aviation Administration governs the guidelines on drones. You have to have a line of sight on your drone and you can't fly over people. Terry says the pilot broke both of these rules. It's just to educate drone users that, that we're out there. We want everybody to enjoy the trails. I mean, it's all public land, but the fact is we have to get along in a peaceful way. Drone actions have consequences. They're not just a harmless toy. It is illegal to shoot a drone out of the sky. The group did file a police report. If you have any information, call police.